here's how to use Visual Studio Code to access databases. Now, first of all, you've got to have one running, right? So I've got a local SQL Server running up here. And what you can do is just simply, when you do the connection, take out the settings from here and copy and paste them in. So, and I've got a password, it's a pretty generic one. And then this, the extension I'm using, which you need, is if you search SQL Server MS SQL, either way, you'll get it. And just install that, and it will come down here under SQL Server. Then you want to press plus on here, and you get the connection dialog. Now give it your name. So let's say I'm just going to give it a really explicit name. Mine was just verb tables I'm doing for a personal project. Now the server name was that okay copy and paste as is and then the sql login the authentication type should match and your username and password it doesn't matter for my password because i'm just making a very quick demo okay so put those in now there's actually more this is a bit confusing i'm going to save that leave your database name blank for a moment okay you could put master but let's just try that and you'll see instantly it's connected now let's get rid of that databases up here and this will all match what you've got in sql server and so if i wanted to do just have a quick look at some data again right click and you can see the query results much like your database a SQL Server Management Studio or any other database RDBMS ID thing will do. So those are that's my data and it matches. And then I can just run my queries, whatever. And I can press the play over here to run that. And you can see it filters. On the right click, you've got a bit more, but that's the general gist of it. It gives you a nice, easy place to access your databases in Visual Studio Code. And in fact, Microsoft are pushing this because they're retiring Azure Data Studio. And at the moment, this is their recommended option, which I find a little bit lacking. But hey, if you found this useful, check out more videos on the channel here. I'll see you soon. Thank you for watching.